Hello there, welcome back to my portion, or a bonus video portion of GoldenEye007, so, uh, let's do some certain things here, shall we? Go to one of my completed, completed files. And let's do something. Indeed. No, let's do better than that. See what we're gonna do here, huh? Destroy some Janus Marines, yeah. Shit doesn't even phase me. Alright, you gotta go, boy. Your mama was calling you. And she told me to tell you that you were a very naughty boy. Shit doesn't even phase you, does it? Oof. Boy, I bet they didn't see that coming. They just can't fight that, can they? Where the hell is the door key? There it is. And uh, where are these guys? Guess not. Pull out my uh, remote mines again. Yeah. All hail the time mines. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this running around bullshit, and I'll stop now, so... Well, there's something I need to tell you, though, I forgot to tell you before. About, uh... <clears throat> once you complete the Egyptian temple on double agent difficulty, as soon as you do that, like I said, the game will be beaten, uh... 100%, and you will unlock a, uh... <clears throat> special difficulty setting, like a customizable difficulty setting, which is 007, where you can edit the uh, enemy health, you can edit the uh, enemy damage, the enemy accuracy, and the enemy reaction speed to however amount you want it, to the highest amount or to the lowest amount, or anywhere in between. Making your like your own difficulty setting. 
So yeah, it's kind of a pretty cool feature. You can't really check them off once you beat them. They're just to play around or play around with. So yeah, it's pretty neat. So yeah, and then beating the game on <coughs> Secret Agent, you get Aztec, and you get Egyptian, like I said, or you need to uh, beat all these previous levels. Everything except this one. All the previous levels on Double O Agent to get this level unlocked. And just beat this in Double O Agent and you'll beat it 100%. And unlock the Double Seven difficulty, like I said. And you get the, uh... Certain, uh, multiplayer, single-player maps, I think, unlocked. I think once you beat, beat them on any difficulty setting on the single-player mode. There are five of them, I think. Facility. Bunker. The second one, uh, archives, caverns, and Egyptian. And then on agent, you unlock a bunch of new uh, multiplayer characters beating the game. Damn through cradle. Just wanted to mention that though too. Why not? But anyway, uh, I'll stop rambling now. I hope you enjoyed this stupid bullshit, and I'll see you later.